my particular experience of secondary school was quite isolating and anxiety provoking. And I had a lot of individuals from different areas of the school, different parts of my day who were quite confrontational, like quite, uh, well, they, they bullied me basically, which, you know, that, that had such a massive impact on how I viewed life and other people when I left secondary school. Is that some, is that something that you've experienced that kind of bullying aspect? I was like traumatized when I left. I didn't know what to do with my life. That's why I say I struggled a bit, even in my twenties, because it was like, I was struck, I was having trouble holding a job. I was unemployed. Most of the jobs I did held were in the nightlife. So like dishwashing mm -hmm. for bars sure, and whatever. And it was like, it just wasn't an easy environment to be in. Your life was a mess. You were like broken, whatever. And you're trying to make something come out of it. That's sure. what made me take rap more seriously at 19 because I just felt like I needed something to do. Part of the reason why I say stay blessed at the end of my videos is that I'm happy that things didn't get worse for me. I'm yeah. blessed every day that I wake up and I got something to fight for for more. Mm -hmm. Well, I'd, you know, when when you were telling me about your your story, sort of in the pre chats, you know, I uh, I identify a lot with you know what you're trying to do at that at that age that you're talking about, around sort of early or late teens, early twenties. My focus was to be an athlete, so I was like, oh, right, I need to to get on that and that sort of endeavor that idea in my head of getting to a certain place was enough to kind of pull me along through all the, the difficult times at school particularly yeah so it was like same with kind of me too like i was a very kind of in his own kind of zone kind of person but yeah. then over time too i did learn how to socialize i had some homies mm. who were club promoters they took me out <laughs> i was like <laughs> So awkward, but I made it work. Yeah, I just yeah. made it work. <laughs> and in a way, I kind of networked away myself through not just my city, but through the whole greater Toronto area. Mm -hmm. So I've been to downtown Toronto. I've been like, I've been to a lot of places. I've been to Toronto even recently for training opportunities to train in some programs. And is that I programs for you or programs that you're helping? No, oh, these are with. programs for me to like train in hip hop and sure, sure. do better, do better in with too. But like, I, I'm happy I went through it and made me into a better artist at the end of the day because it helped condition yourself to work on yourself and uh, figure out more of what you got to do.